For at least the last four decades, Military City USA has welcomed young men and women stationed at JBSA Lackland and Fort Sam Houston to join local families for some home cooking on Thanksgiving. Jesse Degollado introduces us to a couple who has opened their home and their hearts to airmen and soldiers for nearly 30 years. There were just two boys that year, I remember that. They were among the more than 200 other young trainees Jim and Paula Foy have welcomed into their home for Thanksgiving. And this one particular guy, I never will forget it. He kept eating, kept eating, he kept eating. And then about 3 o'clock in the afternoon, he said, have you got any Tums? <laughs> one of many memories that began 28 years ago. You saw it on TV and yeah. you said, I want to do that. Jim Foy says he wanted them to have what he didn't have back when he was at Lackland. When I was in the service, they didn't have this. You had to stay on base. This year, they have six guests, four from Lackland, two more from Fort Sam Houston, each grateful to be here. I did not think that I was going to have like a nice Thanksgiving dinner. I thought I was going to be sitting in a mess hall, so it feels great. Because we were waiting for this day, like Thanksgiving, to go out, get off a base, and eat food at someone's home. So, like, I'll definitely remember this. The Foy's say they certainly will. Everyone at their table may have been strangers at first, now they're family. Our home can be their home away from home just for this one day. Jesse de Guillado. It's delicious, man. Oh, and here's cranberry. KSAT 12 News.